good morning and happy first day of school i am a junior this year that is wild to me i still feel like i'm a freshman but i'm a junior i'm officially an upperclassman i just don't believe it it's 6 55 i'll come at 6 30 and i started getting ready and wash my face read some proverbs because you know i still want to dedicate some time to god in the morning you know really start my day off right prayer and with him I'm about to curl my hair as you can see so i'm just preparing that all i do is i brush my hair out and i also put the part in because you can't really do that once it's curly guys look like at my mom with me she got me my body scent in the big lotion a new perfume and the body wash this is Pink Pineapple Sunrise, if you didn't know, love it so much. I also like to divide my hair up in a section, just so there's less hair everywhere. And now, we do some hairspray, then we get started. to look nice on my first day of school but guess what it's picture day okay i finished curling my hair and now it's time to get dressed all right guys here's the outfit i love it so much now it's time to accessorize i'm gonna wear my faith over fear necklace that i wear pretty much every day i don't know what other necklace i'm gonna wear i'm gonna try to layer it with speak now but it has to lay just right. Wow! I'm gonna wear these braided hoops I got from Francesca. I have not shaken or brushed or like fingered out my curls yet. That's why they look so funky. Next, we have some rings from my mom's that she let me, let me wear. And what a first day video without recreating our picture. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna go eat some breakfast and I'm gonna leave soon. I'm so excited. All right, here she is. Black top is from Old Navy, shorts are JCPenney, and shoes are Converse. That's the fit. Hi, guys, I am back from school. It's 5 8. It's been a while. I got home. My dad and I went to drop a couple things off that he needed to drop off, and then we ran to a coffee shop and I picked up a coffee. And now I'm like knee deep into syllabuses and all of that. So it's not bad. I'm just trying to like sort through everything. Cause like, like I've said, starting Monday, we're not allowed to carry backpacks to class. So I'm trying to figure out the best way to organize this all. And I'm taking two AP classes this year. Honestly, I need to tell you all all about my classes. Okay, I'll run you all through my day. So I started off, um, I went to Met up with a couple of my friends, talked to them. It was super fun just catching up. We walked around and all. And then we went to our homeroom. So everyone has a homeroom, but we only go to it like at the beginning of the year like this. And then like a couple times throughout the year. But we just went through like the first day procedure. We got through that and then our principals, they do this like assembly. Pretty much talk about the same things that they talk about in homeroom. So like no drugs, no violence, all like just the basic like what to do in case of an emergency like all that stuff just kind of important first day things to go through but your third year doing it it gets very mundane and just like and then after that it was like right around 11 10 or so and so that's like usually when first lunch starts so how my school does lunches is like if your fourth period is downstairs you go to first second third lunch then fourth but if your fourth period's upstairs you get a fourth second third fourth then lunch so you like first lunch second lunch and it depends on your first pe fourth period if it's upstairs or downstairs my fourth period this year is upstairs so i have second lunch and i like it i love second lunch i cannot complain second lunch is superior in my opinion so we went straight to fourth period after homeroom just so they could do the lunches so i went to my fourth period um it's ap human geography it's gonna be such a fun class taught by one of my favorite teachers he's super cool and he says he's one of his favorites to teach so i'm really excited just to learn about you know the world in more of like a geo way okay my bad is bad guy 
we're back. So after um, fourth period, I went to lunch. It was good. A lot of my friends are in there, so I got to sit with them, talk to them. Pizza, we had pizza for lunch. It was good. I was so hungry. So it hit the spot. After that, we started to back up at first period. So my first period driver's ed. I love it. It's gonna be fun. We actually get to drive in there and just learn some skills. So I have learners that on my license yet. So it's gonna help me with my test and all. And then second period is humans anatomy and physiology. And that class is gonna be fun. I like the teachers. He seems really chill and like funny. Third period is AP language and composure or something like that. But it's like AP AP learning. It's taught by one of my all like all time favorite teachers. I love her so much. There's like eight people in that class, such a small class, but it's fun and it's gonna be a good class. And then fourth period AP human geography. We didn't go to that then because we'd already went to it. Today was a little confusing. And then we went to fifth period, which is honors pre-calc trig. Teacher's really cool. Everyone really likes him. He's like a super genius or something. And then sixth period is test prep. My school offers for all juniors, as it's pretty much mandatory, for juniors to take test prep, which is SAT prep, because we get a free SC SAT test. And then seventh period is honors contemporary studies. It's like a U.S. like it's from World War One to now. So I'm really excited for that class. That teacher is pretty much like my AP Human Geography teacher, but older. Like, they're really similar. They're goofy. They're funny. Interactive. So I'm really excited for all those. And so, I don't even know what I was saying like, at the beginning of this clip. Where it made me, like, want to start telling you all about my classes. <laughs> but overall, I had a really good day. It was a good day. Very long. Like, I don't know anyone else if you just feel, like, absolutely pooped after the first day. I did. I was like... And then I had some coffee. I'm feeling pretty good. If we could run it back and do you wonder If we could run it back If we could Hey guys! What's up? It's 6 o'clock, 6.40 And I decided to shower because I wanted to So I got everything organized I feel really good about my whole system I have And I can carry everything because I have two binders But I'm gonna have one dropped off in my locker but if i can't get to my locker if i need to carry them i do like i kind of like made a stone of how i carry them all in one of my videos i do my skincare so i feel like you're sick and tired of it because i know i am i feel like it's that and making my bed like it's really, like the two and reading my bible but i'm not tired of showing you reading my bible like i'm tired of showing you like i make my bed and i do my skincare I feel like it's so boring. Plus, we only have two products of skincare now instead of the ordinary serum. I just have a lot more. I feel like it's extra boring. Like, there's no, like, fun aspect to it. Okay, I'm going to start planning out my week next week. This is my daily planner. Um, I'm not sure what brand it is, but I love it. It's a spiral, so it lays out very nicely. So, I'm going to just write down a couple things I need to get done. All right, guys, I'm on the couch all cozied up. Uh, we had dinner. It was so good. It was grilled steak, asparagus, rice, zucchini, all that good stuff. I want to read some of my books. I'm on page 160. I want to get to, like, 200 tonight. So I think I'm just going to read for this the night and chill out. It's been a long week. I've been at student council. I've like, been at school the whole week for student council. So there's just been a lot going on. 